Hello, this is Maria reporting for smartphonebusiness.com. We're at the Mobile World Congress in Barcelona and we're with uh, Vidya with Adolfo Martin. Hello, Adolfo. Hello, nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Uh, can you please tell us a bit about the product and what it is that you're presenting here at the Mobile World Congress? Sure, absolutely. Well, basically, BDA is a platform that allows users with a 3D phone um, to uh, be able to establish a video call with any other user and depending on the platform that he's running. For, for example, it could be a PC user or it could be um, a user running a high-end um, soft, uh, soft phone or video phone like Tamber or Polycom. So the idea basically is that actually you have uh, corporations that uh, use this kind of uh, high price uh, devices and you have users that use, for example, a Skype uh, soft phones. So what we have done is to join together these two kinds of users and now allow through um, what is called a flash gateway that any user within a, um, a PC, a computer, uh, with a flash uh, application may be able to connect to either a 3G user with a phone call, a 3G phone call, or with a Tanber or Polycom device. Okay, so that is it's a very simple but powerful idea. Okay, so we, maybe we can see it. Okay, so basically, what the user may do is to write the name of a URL and then a Flash application. The very important thing is they don't have to install anything. No problem with firewalls. It will go to the AT port to the uh, HTTP port. So, so the user will write the IP address, destination, and then it will place the video call, and on the uh, destination device, we'll be able to see what the other user is looking at. Okay, so, and this, by the conference, is established. Very simple idea, but very powerful, and well, we think very useful. Tell me, how has the reception been so far here at the Congress? Well, I think very good. Um, our idea is that uh, telecom operators are the one that will be willing to have this kind of devices. It will allow uh, multi-video conferencing between any kind of user, either in mobility or behind a computer. So uh, we think that it will be very well accepted by, by telecom operators. Uh, so that's what we are willing, and that's what, what's what we are presenting. Excellent. So, so what uh, do you foresee for 2010? Well, 2010 seems to be a hard year for everybody, and specifically for, um, well, that's video. Video is something which is necessary, but maybe not all companies are going to invest a lot of money in this kind of, of uh, devices. But the good thing is that uh, companies need to save money, and this will allow to save a lot of money in traveling expenses. So that's why we think uh, this year may be a good year. But the problem is somebody needs to invest. So that's what we are looking for. Okay. Well, I think all investors have heard you. Thank you. Thank you very, very much you. for the interview. <laughs> Thank you very much.